evening is three rounds in the Cage Legacy Featherweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, weighing in under 145 pounds. Fighting out of SBG, presenting Carl McCown! And his opponent making his way to the cage, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, weighing in under 145 pounds. Fighting out of SBG Cork! Presenting Dylan O'Donovan! Cage Legacy 4 in the TLT tier and draw it. This is Noel O'Keefe and Keith Kavner in the commentary booth and we are in the featherweight division SBG facing SBG of course it's SBG Concord Carl McCann taking on SBG Cork still in O'Donovan this is one that jumped off the card this is the fight I'm most excited for of all the fights on this card tonight I think and we are underway a touch of gloves and McCann leading with a double jab and both fighters engaging, throwing heavy shots. O'Donovan looking for that home for that right hand. And a good block there by McCann with the, the high kick. Throws a high kick of his own, lands a beautiful stiff left jab as well. But Dylan O'Donovan lands his own left. Carl pressing him against the fence. And he, Carl is a Brazilian Jiu Jitsu blue belt. He's been a blue belt for a few years. Looking for the takedown, didn't quite get it. Good defense there by Dylan Donovan. O'Donovan now, again, wide base, and he's got to be careful. McCann looking for that. Looking for that ankle pick as well. Not a bad corner, if you might say so. And Carl no. McCann, he's got Richie Smullen and the godfather of Irish MMA, John Cavanagh, in his corner. Of course, Smullen fighting for the Bama title, not too far away in the 10th of November. Handed by McCann. Good work by McCann here up against the cage. Just softening out Donovan up with some knees. He's winning that head position every time as well. Looking for that single as well. More to rip away from the cage. He gets it and ends up in the guard of O'Donovan. Good work by O'Donovan to get back up to his feet. His feet. Beautiful. Carl McCann's got the two hands looking class. Looking to take the, the back. back. He's got it. Good work. Good work by Carl. Heavy pressure now, looking to pass. Credit you there as well to Dylan O'Donovan, who had his back taken, but he got half guard back right at least. Forward. Yeah. Carl McCann, just for a moment, just happy to sit here and land some softening hammer fists. And O'Donovan pushes up and lands a heavier shot there. Not uncommon in MMA to sit in half guard and land the shots from here. GSP was also very good at this sort of system. And again, head position on the mat here again, Keith, is uh, very important. Oh, and again, Carl McCann is, is utilizing it brilliantly. Gets into side control now. And again, O'Donovan's got to be careful of his back. He's setting up that Kamora. No, not anymore. Again, nice shots from side control. Knee on belly and after some heavy some shots. Heavy shots by Carl McCann. Excellent work by Carl McCann. Dylan O'Donovan does well to get back up. Lands his own uppercut there, exchanging up against the cage. Nothing really landing good. Head movement, boy McCann in there. Seems to be connecting with arms a lot when Donovan was throwing those shots. We're just up against the cage in front of us here again, Keith. Again, Kyle winning that head positioning. Head position. Nice uppercut there by Dylan O'Donovan on the break. Lands a big right hand that rocked back the head of McCann. And he's chasing it now. Goal just after the bell, oh, McCann, man, completely accidental, man. the bell just went, he was in the motion of throwing the shot, definitely not intentional, but a great first round, and O'Donovan can take some spirit by landing a big shot at the end of the first. An excellent opening round for Carl McCann, but Dylan Donovan can have some heart from how he finished around, landed some good shots on his feet just at the end, but you feel Carl McCann done enough to take the first round. Just getting ready to get on their way for round two here at Cage Legacy 4. A nice right hook there and a straight left foot there. Exchange going toe to toe. O'Donovan trying to land some big shots. Oh. Steady back fist. 
by Carl McCann landed right on the chin. Right in the pen by Carl. McCann heavy ground and pound. What a spinning back fist, Keith. McCann was on the retreat and he just threw the spinning oh, back fist that landed beautifully on O'Donovan's chin. O'Donovan able to cover his guard at the end, though. Good recovery by O'Donovan. Beautiful, oh, beautiful I work. I feeling after that backhand. Have the lights turned back on and O'Donovan, that's the thing, he was rocked, McCann beautiful into neon belly, the mount is there if he wants it, Carl heavy shots, neon belly position. Derek Black looking closely, Carl McCann feels the finish and he's hunting it, looking to take the back, I think he's content with just landing those shots from the back, the rover take the back from his there corner, one hook, O'Donovan needs to get his back to the mat and start to recover. Start O'Donovan is in guard. serious trouble here. Karl McCann has landed some heavy punishing shots. All coming from that spinning back fist, but heavy ground and pound by the SPG man. He's in full mount at this stage. Arm trapped, landing shots. Your referee Here's looking very McCann. closely. It and over. it has been stopped. A beautiful performance by Karl McCann. The spinning back fist starts it all and finished it with ground and pound. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mr. Derek Black is calling for the X-Men round number two. For your winner, the ground and pound.